The Roll-Off Speed Hub is one of the most advanced shifting systems on the planet. And with that advanced technology, there are some more steps that you will need to take when removing that rear wheel from your frame. Today we're going to learn how to remove your rear wheel equipped with that roll-off system from your bike. First step you want to do is you want to make sure that your bike is turned off. Next, locate the communication cable and unplug it from the shifter. Once the shifter is unplugged and there is no electricity going to the speed hub, go ahead and unlatch the quick release skewer. This will allow you to remove the rear wheel from the frame as if you were doing it on any normal bicycle. You want to keep track of the orientation of the belt tensioner or chain tensioner so that you can put the wheel back in its place correctly. With the wheel removed from the frame, you can now replace your tube and or tire. If you don't know how to do this, we have a great video showing you how to do so by clicking that tab above. Now that your tube has been replaced, we're ready to put the wheel back on the frame. Keep track of that belt tensioner and make sure that the axles go all the way into those dropouts. Now tighten the skewer and latch it firmly so that the wheel doesn't come off the frame. Lastly, connect that communication cable so that the shifter can work properly. Before you start riding, turn the bike on and make sure that the gears shift correctly. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss another tech tip. Until next time, enjoy the ride.